me, Savannah, and today I'm going to be showing you what is in my beach bag. I just got back from Myrtle Beach with my family for 4th of July. It was so much fun. I got to see all my cousins, my aunt, my uncle, Nana and Papa. Um, it was a great time, and I got some color, which I'm pretty stoked about. A few of you guys asked me on Twitter what I carry in my beach bag, so I thought I'd just make a video about it and show ya. So, first things first, you need a beach bag. So I got this cute little straw bag. It's from Century 21. I got it in New York, and it was only like 20 bucks. I really love it because it's super roomy. I mean, it's, it's huge. I could carry an infant in here if I really wanted to. So, in my beach bag, I carry the following. The first thing that I always, always bring to a beach is a book. One of my favorite things to do is sit next to the beach, see the cute little kids playing around, and just read a book. Um, I love the atmosphere of that, and it's just one of my favorite things to do. So, uh, one of my favorite books right now is this um, book called A Place of Yes by Bethany Frankel. And it is just so inspiring and so motivating and, and positive and inspirational, and I'm just a huge fan of it. So you guys should go check this out. It's actually kind of old, but I just heard about it and um, had to go get it because the reviews are amazing. The next thing I put in my beach bag is a little zip-up thing that has money in it. Um, you never know if you're going to need to buy a drink or if you want a little snack. So just carry, you know, some money in a little, little zipper um, bag. This one's so cute, it's from Free People, and um, I mean, just bring a few bucks just in case, you never know. Next thing is sunscreen. Make sure you wear sunscreen. It is super important for being in the sun. You guys should know that. No news to you. Next thing I bring is my phone, of course, because I love taking pictures, and especially when I was with, you know, my family that I don't see that much um, at Myrtle Beach, I wanted to take a ton of pictures. However, make sure you keep it in the shade because it can get too hot and then the temperature thing comes on your iPhone and then it just shuts off for a while. Um, but I do bring my phone, but I make a promise to myself before I go there not to go on it unless I'm going to take a picture because, you know, you're spending quality time and you're at the beach with your friends and family and you don't need to be texting people. Next thing that I always bring with me is this tinted lip balm. Um, so it's very, it has kind of like a bronze tint to it, um, it's from Ulta, and it has SPF in it, and it's just always great to kind of put on right before you're going in the sun, um, to save those lips of yours. One of the most important things is sunglasses, and not just any kind of sunglasses, big sunglasses, like these. I love these sunglasses, they're amazing and huge, and they're very Lennon-like, um, and you know I love me some John Lennon. I think I got these... Forever 21. Uh, next thing is hand sanitizer. Uh, for some reason, I always feel like I need to um, use hand sanitizer when I'm at the beach. Um, and you guys may disagree, but I don't. I don't. I don't disagree. I agree. I. You need. You need hand sanitizer. And last thing is a magazine. I know that I had a book, but sometimes you kind of get tired of reading a book and you just want to look at pictures and go through a magazine, so I always carry a magazine with me. And this is something that I, I don't put in my beach bag, but I wear it to the beach, um, but I thought I'd just include it, is a beach cover-up. Um, you never want to wear just your swimsuit there, like always have a beach cover up because you never know if you're gonna like leave the beach for a little bit to grab a bite to eat and then go back to the beach. Um, this is one of my favorite cover ups that I have. It's from H&M and it's just so cute. Um, I don't know if you can see the detailing but there's like little tigers or horses. I don't even know what that is but it's gold and has like a little shimmer to it and it's so cute and it's very light. I know that it's black so you're probably like oh you'd be so hot and sweaty but you're not because it's very light material and I Love it. So that's what I carry in my beach bag. I uh, hope you guys enjoy it. Leave a comment, let me know what you carry in your beach bag, and maybe you can give me a few hints on what to bring to my next beach trip. Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you next Sunday. Mwah! Bye! So now this part is braided, and I'm just going to move it in front of the sock blend.